right oh my god i missed you so much i am back with another abercrombie and fitch haul for winter kind of like a winter um fashion situation you guys really love why am i going like this you guys really love the other one that i did which i'll link up here for you guys and i figured let's do round two so without further ado if you guys want to see me try on all these new pieces from ever call me a fitch my first impressions and how i would style them then please keep on watching so if you guys watched my latest haul i did include two denim that i got and then i added two of the jackets that they also sent over just for like um you know friday and for me to like put things outfits together so first let's start with like a bodysuit as you guys can see it is red what caught my eyes the fact that it is literally like shaped to like an hourglass figure which means it's probably super flattering i love the maroon brown reddish color for the holidays i think the bust area right here is like super nice and feminine as it has a nice cut to it and i feel like it's gonna look really nice and flattering so let's go ahead and put this on Okay, so here we have the first top. It is exactly what I thought it would be. It's really nice and fitting, and I don't have to necessarily wear a bra with this. It feels very nice and secure. I think it's absolutely perfect for the fall. The sleeves are not too long. It fits just right, and with this leather moment, something about knit and leather looks so sexy and so like street style for the holidays. So I know I'll be getting lots of use out of this bodysuit and I feel like this color like this maroon color looks really stunning on all skin tones and if you're not somebody that likes to wear red I think this is like the second best to wear that still feels like holiday a little bit of color and it's still aesthetic and neutral for your wardrobe and then I just went ahead and paired it up with my knee-high suede black boots that I'll link for you guys I wear these boots literally with everything but yeah this is the bodysuit right here I'm pretty sure they have other colors I feel like a black and a nude would be absolutely stunning. So um, yeah, I'll link all of those for you guys. And then I just have this little shirt bag that I'm gonna be pairing up with all the outfits just to keep it nice and easy and very like winter. So yeah, first piece was an absolute success. Up next we have another top. This is a beautiful brown corset top. So like the, the look of it is corset, but the actual material and fabric is kind of nice and loose, like a very thin fabric and mostly corsets or tops like this you have to like put in with hooks or a zipper and I think it's very convenient that it's actually stretchy in the back so it makes it really easy to put on and stretchy let's say you were out to dinner and you know the belly gets a little full so those corsets can make you a little tight so there's room to breathe here and again I love how thick the straps are I like that it's not see-through and again such a sexy sophisticated option for a night out in the winter and then you can pair it up with a jacket or a coat which is what I'm going to do I still haven't worn this coat from Eric Crombie but I'm just waiting for like the right opportunity and for the weather to drop for me to be able to wear this but I feel like it is such, but I feel like it is such a staple. I mean, look at this. I mean, you could tell you wear this for a night out and then you can like hang your coat and then this is your outfit. So you can keep yourself nice and warm. Everything is really cute and aesthetic. It's still very stylish for the winter, which is kind of my vibe. I really don't like to be bundled up. I'd rather wear something that's really, really warm and then bam, take it out and then I'm ready to rumble. But this is like the whole outfit together is kind of a vibe i seriously will find any excuse to wear this and post it on the gram but i think this colorway right here the situation is just so pretty and just so flattering and i'm sure this kind of look would look amazing on all body types and literally anybody so this this is like the look baby right here up next we have a really casual look you guys know i love my fleece and my pullovers and this one is kind of cropped but it's also very fitted i like how it has the long zipper so you can like pull it down if you want to for a more like athletic look and then you can pull it up and then it becomes more like a crop top and then you could even like tuck it in if you wanted to and play along with it and it's so nice and cozy i do own a black zip up hoodie from them and I do love it, but this sweatshirt is everything. I like how sweatshirts kind of go over like my sleeves, my hands, like a little Ariana Grande moment. And it honestly just looks so cozy, perfect for lounging or 
you know, running out, do errands. You could also like dress it up, but I like to wear this kind of fleece with leggings, sweatpants, or even these jeans that are from Abercrombie from their curvy collection. So, and it also be cute to like bundle up, like let's say you wanted to wear like a leather jacket if it's a little colder. It'll also look super cute underneath as it'll still keep you warm. Put the collar out like this, very cute. Oh my God, it's so comfy. Okay, here we have this little dress that I was trying to get last time I did the haul, but I was it was not available. And the best part is, it has shorts built in underneath, and it's that really nice um, Spanx legging material. It even has like a slot right here to put your phone, your wallet, your keys, um, some gum, whatever, some AirPods. This is the kind of dress that you wear anywhere so for me that i live in la and then i travel to florida and then i don't really travel to color states this makes sense for me to wear with some boots i like it because i don't have to worry it's like a whole built-in situation i like how it's nice and thin material and it has a nice built-in support right here if you don't want to wear a bra which i literally never do and it's so cute and flattering look at it i am obsessed it's really hard for me to find this because if they're not short enough they make me look short even though i'm 5'5 five five, it's really weird so this one literally takes all the boxes for me and i love that it's not see-through and you could literally dress it down for some sportswear or dress it up i also did get this flannel right here which is so funny because i always get flannels for jason because i find them to have like the more like moody colors Usually flannels for girls are like bright colors and yellows and like, I don't like that. I like the moodier tone. So when I seen this flannel on the website, I was like, I need to have it. And it's girls because boys flannels tend to be just super big and oversized, which is fine. But I wouldn't mind like a more fit situation. And it has like a really dark forest green and a very, very dark like indigo navy blue. So I figured I could pair it up with this dress or anything else that I own really. Just to add a little bit more to the outfit, where is my bag? This outfit just screams winter in like LA <laughs> basically. But I think it's super cute and this with sneakers will look super pretty as well. And the flannel, as you can see, is the right length for my arms and also like the dress. So, oh my god, I am super obsessed. There's also another way that I would like to wear, I just dropped my purse, the flannel. You can literally like go like this for like a more preppy look. Let's say you don't want to tie it around your waist. So you can like wear it like this and then hold your back or like... You know, one shoulder situation and it looks really, really cute. Or like I said, you could even like tie it around your waist. It's cute and also, side note, if you, love to, if you like to dress up to go to Disney, this will be like the perfect dress to take with you and you don't have to worry about anything. But this might be like my favorite pick from the whole thing, yet. Yeah. Okay, here we have this silky button down black top. Again, I just like the quality of Abercrombie and Fitch is just so good. A lot of these times when you buy them from like other places, these kind of shirts and materials kind of like fall through because of like the clarity or the material and it might look a little bit more like cheapy, but I have never owned a black silk top as beautiful as this one and like such an amazing fit. I love that. I, for me, I would actually open it up all the way down like this for like a more sexy vibe and then I pair it up with the Abercrombie um, curvy black denim which is super, super cute. But um, yeah, you guys know I love my long sleeve. I like my blouses and this is just so cool. And like, this is something that's just a staple in anyone's closet. You can pair up with jeans, boots, shorts, dress it up, dress it down, wear a baseball cap with it. But this is more like a date night kind of situation for me per se. So um, let's see how it looks with this. And you can pair it up with the black leather jacket or again, you can go in with the teddy coat. Which I think it'll give it like a nice like pretty contrast to wearing like an all black outfit. I do have on some like brown chocolate booties. Sexy, yes. It's giving like nighttime city vibes with this fit right here. And then here are the booties. They're like a nice chocolate brown color. Kind of pointing like stiletto-y. So I think it's super, super cute. Alright guys, well this concludes today's try on haul. Trying on these new clothes that I got from Abercrombie and Fitch. 
I will leave all the clothes down below, they put their sizing and if they are sold out, I will have the most similar one um, instead. But I hope you guys like this video. I will, again, I will leave down the previous haul. If you guys missed it, if you want to watch it, don't forget to thumbs up, subscribe and with all that being said, I love you guys so much. I hope you guys are having an amazing holiday season. Muchos besitos y abrazos. Bye guys.